Yo, what is going on guys? So today I'm gonna to be showing you exactly how to downgrade your iPhone from iOS 14 back to iOS 13. Guys, right here, there's this downgrade plus plus app that will uninstall iOS 14 and reinstall iOS 13. So as you can see right here, it says the iOS downgrade tool to iOS 13. All you have to do is click the downgrade button. And as you can see, it detects our device properly. We are on an iPhone 11 and we are currently on iOS 14, but I'm honestly not a big fan of it. So I'm going to go ahead and delete this app for now though. So let's go ahead and press delete on here. And uh, we're going to go ahead and run through this entire process together, guys. So the first thing that you're going to want to have to do is make sure that your settings are enabled correctly. So you need to go down here to your settings app, and there's going to be two different settings. One is called background app refresh, which is under general, and one is low power mode. So let's go ahead and start with the one under general and it's called background app refresh one more time. So if you don't see it, it's right here in the middle and we're going to go ahead and click on that one right here. And we're going to see background app refresh pop up right here at the top. So let's go ahead and select that one and you guys will see Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi and mobile data. Either one of those two guys will work. So we're going to go ahead and pick the Wi-Fi and mobile data because as you can see up there in the top right, I'm currently not on Wi-Fi, um, but now, the next part, guys, is to make sure that you have low power mode turned off. So low power mode, guys, has to be turned off. So go down here to your battery menu. This is back under the main settings menu, and you will see low power mode. It's going to be a toggle right here. And if it's turned on, guys, you will see your battery up in the top right go to yellow. And if that's yellow, guys, obviously that means low power mode is on. So you need to get to this setting right here and make sure it's turned off. Once you do that, guys, then you are all set. That is literally all you have to do to be able to get the Downgrade++ Plus Plus app on your device. So now go ahead and open up your Safari browser. Guys, make sure you do use Safari. We're going to go to this website right here. It's iohelper.co. iohelper.co. And as you can see, guys, there are all of these different apps on here with different categories, some of the latest updated apps, guys, some trending apps, all sorts of different things. But we're going to select this apps menu. And as you can see, they have unlimited Apple Music. They have Spotify Plus Plus. They have the App Store Plus Plus for free in-app purchases, guys. They have all sorts of different apps. And you can go down here and just take like maybe a minute, two minutes, and scroll down through these entire apps, guys, and take a look at everything that they have to offer. Only at iohelper.co, but we're going to click on the search bar right here and then just type in down. And you will see Downgrade++ Plus Plus right there on the screen. So let's go up, oh, let me get rid of that, and let's go ahead and select Downgrade++. Plus Plus. We're gonna get this app, so all you have to do is select the icon that it shows, then tap Add to Home Screen. So there's the icon down there. We're just gonna tap on that and then scroll up a little bit, and you will see Add to Home Screen. Let's go ahead and add this to the home screen right here, guys. And then click Add one more time right here in the top right corner guys as soon as you click add you will see the downgrade app pop up on your device and you can access it and downgrade from ios 14 back to ios 13 because as of right now it's just a little bit more stable guys and you know there's so many apps that are that just are acting a little bit wonky on on ios 14 guys Definitely go check out all of the different apps that iohelper.co has to offer. They have so many different things. So once you get back to iOS 13, you can check out all of their different Instagram++ plus plus apps, Snapchat++, plus plus, all different types of things, guys. But thank you so much for watching this video and have fun.